So recently I started using Unreal Engine 5 for all the new music videos that I'm working on and it has been a crazy process, let me, let me tell you that. But you know, there's just a couple things that I wish I knew before even opening Unreal Engine. First one is a um, little bit of a bummer for me, but I'm just gonna try to save you the hassle. Mac is just not the answer. I've been editing on my iMac Pro for such a long time now and it's been such a good workhorse, but to be honest, it just did not do the trick for me. I did a ton of research trying to figure out if Apple products were compatible with Unreal Engine 5 and it's just not. I did a couple test examples I can show you right here of a couple things that I did with Unreal Engine on my iMac Pro, but what ended up happening was my computer actually ended up getting so bogged down from the heavy graphics work that my computer just kind of stopped working with the software on it. I had to clear everything off and buy myself a PC. That's the only way I was gonna get through the project. I think it's just because the graphics card and everything that uh, is put into Apple computers just does not want to communicate well with Epic Games. Epic Games is the launcher for Unreal Engine. So I also heard that Epic Games and Apple got into a little bit of a lawsuit together and they just are not going to talk to each other anytime soon. So key things that you're going to want to use in Unreal Engine are Nanite and Lumen and those are just not even available while editing on a Mac computer. So Nanite is actually now available for Mac computers, but Lumen still gives a really weird purple hue to the lighting. And Nanite is basically just a high detail geometry system. And Lumen is a high detail system for lighting. The other thing that doesn't really make sense to me, and maybe Epic Games can reach out to me and let me know what the heck is going on, but you can export in Apple ProRes on a PC, but not on a Mac. Make it make sense. So yeah, I, I, I bought a PC. I had to. And I'm really glad I did because Unreal Engine just works so good. I can fly through the software now without having any problems and it just, it just works. Okay, the other thing I wish I knew was uh, when you film your subject on a green screen to put into Unreal Engine, Putting it into the software is not as easy as it sounds. There's a lot of hoops you gotta jump through before even doing that. It, it, Unreal Engine is not a video editing software. It is a game engine first. You have to jump through a lot of hoops in, in order to even get your subject in the environment that you built. So my recommendation is using image planes, put it up to where you want your subject to be, and then use a skeletal mesh which is like a the size of what a human would be like. So you can kind of put them up to where your image plane is and then size up your green screened subject according to what the skeletal mesh is. So that way you can have a proper scale of your subject. And this is the third thing, but they kind of they kind of tie together. You're gonna need to start using PNG or EXR sequences. I'm very new to Unreal Engine and I'm going to be sharing everything that I learned along the way with you guys. But basically, EXR and PNG sequences are exactly what you think they are. They are just a gigantic amount of pictures exported frame by frame from your project that you exported in DaVinci or After Effects or Premiere or whatever you're using. At first, I didn't, I just didn't get it. But what you have to do is loop that in through a path and you connect that to your image plane in order for your subject to show up. And that to me was like so weird and I didn't understand it and I just couldn't get my mind wrapped around it, but I'm explaining it to you now so you don't have to go through all the trouble that I did. And you know, there's a couple other things that I want to get into the details of in terms of using Unreal Engine, but this was just kind of a off the top of my head type of video while I was thinking about it. and. I just finished a project up. I'm really excited about it. It just came out the other day. I did it all in Unreal Engine 5. I'm also getting the new office all set up. I moved into my new house and um, I don't know, I just have been so busy. I've been, I went to Australia, I went to Vegas. I, you know, I've been all over the place filming all kinds of different projects for clients and I kind of, kind of left you guys hanging a little bit, I'm sorry. I'm gonna make it up to you. I'm back in my own, space now finally and getting everything set up and 
when I can, I'm gonna be putting out as much information as I can so that way you guys can learn with me. So thank you for watching, hit the subscribe button, and I will see you guys later. Bye-bye.